Well, I just saw Bernard's sidecar, and he's, you won some races with it, right? Well, we haven't won yet. We're haven't getting close. Haven't won yet. <laughs> so either you're winning because the guy's not good enough, or you need a better frame. And we're going to go with the thing that you need a better frame. That's what's holding you back. That's it. You could have won if you'd had a halfway decent frame. Well, this frame we have is designed before World War II. Yeah, okay. The suspension is ancient, so yeah. I want to build a state-of-the-art sidecar. Okay, so that's what we do. This is a sidecar frame, which, which obviously looks nothing like a motorcycle frame. Explain what we got here. Well, this is the frame, like you say, it's not like a motorcycle, it's more like a three-wheel car. Uh, and the reason for doing all of this is so we can put like A-frame suspension on it, right. like we have on the formula car. So it'll be hub center steering in the front, A-frame suspension, uh, and it'll make the tires work a lot better than what we is have Is there any now. rules to motorcycle sidecar racing? Does it have to have 80% motorcycle, or, or this is basically a Formula One car with three it, wheels, right? This is what it's referred to. It's a Formula yeah. One sidecar. Okay. Uh, it's more of a three-wheel car than it is a, a motorcycle with a sidecar. Right. Um, there is some rules on, on, on the length of it mm -hmm. uh, and the width and the tire offset and all that. And what are so we using for tubing? This is 4130 chromoly steel. Okay. Uh, it's very light. I hope it's going to be considerably lighter than what we have now. What do you figure it'll weigh when you're done? Well... I'm trying to stay under 500 pounds. Okay. For the whole rig? For the whole rig. Wow. So, so you better not get on it. But <laughs> I'm working on that too. All right, there you go. <laughs> and what motor are you going to be using? The same motor? Uh, no, I'm trying to get a BMW 1000. Yeah. The okay. S1000. It's oh, the most. Okay. The new one. The new one. Yeah, yeah. It's the most powerful motor on the market right, right now. Right, right. 200 horse. So we'll we'll keep you updated as we go along here on the uh, on the progress. So very good. So the advantage we have is we have all this equipment that we can use to make this thing. Hold it. We're gonna fish mouth this tube so it fits up against the round tubing. Gotta do both sides. So, we got a fish mouth tube. We're gonna stick that in the frame. I'm gonna weld this piece of tubing in here to mount the suspension on it. What we're doing now is just tacking the tubing together with a heliarch. Uh, when everything is in place, we're gonna weld it up. Actually, we're gonna braze it the way the English race car frames used to be built. So that, but that'll be a whole different process. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 